Hello, everybody, and welcome to this very special video where I'm going to show you how you can use DeepSeek to write content completely for free that will rank on Google. Let's get into it. So I've got this prompt here. Feel free to use this prompt. I will leave a link to this prompt in the description. There will also be a link to talk with us if you are curious about us doing some work for you, some SEO, etc. There will be a link here in the prompt. But basically, this prompt is a very, very simple prompt. Um, you can go through it for yourselves. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to get the inputs, okay? So basically, there are a couple of inputs here. There's the keyword. So obviously, for the keyword, you can just put whatever you want for men in 2025. And then for internal links, what you want to do is you want to go to your sitemap like this. And then let's say we want links to our collections. So we'll just do this. And then you can control A, control C to copy the entire sitemap. And then you want to put it in between the XML tags. By the way, if you want to edit this, go to file, make a copy. Do not ask to be an editor on this thing. Okay. Just make a copy and um, do it that way. It's much easier. So then we want to do this and then paste like that. That will then, uh, you can do control shift, uh, V, uh, and that will paste it directly into it. And then finally, we've got image embeds. Again, the way that we want to do this is we want to go to, for example, our sneaker page here and then drag down like this. So let's just drag all these sneakers, highlight all these sneakers. Control C to copy, go to paste to markdown.com or paste to markdown. Sorry, just Google that. And there we go. There's uh, the links that we want to use. So we will control A, control C this. These are image links, remember? Okay. So we'll put these inside image embeds like this inside the XML tags, just like before. So we'll drag all the way down, all the way down to the bottom and then control shift V to paste. Now we have our entire prompt, okay? So just to clarify what this is, is it's an, it's an SEO writing prompt, okay? So ensure to include all anchor text links to internal links and make all images clickable with their relevant URLs. Um, use relevant internal links and don't just use the same internal link over and over. Look particularly for brand links, for example. Okay. Use the information on the keyword from below and generate a fully SEO optimized article. Ensure to use all of the relevant features of Markdown in order to create a truly unique and powerful ranking article. This includes lists and tables. This will include headings, image embeds, lists, bold, and also if you want to make a more complicated data visualization or something, you can use HTML. You must include 12 headings in the entire article with 300 to 500 words for each heading include frequently asked questions at the very bottom of the article, which you can think about logically. What questions might someone ask about the keyword, Write So that a seven year old would be able to understand what you're writing. You can change this number if you want. Take the persona of an expert in the niche on this topic specifically ensuring to add parts of the article that only the expert would be able to add to such an article, including personal anecdotes and expert pieces of advice. Don't use marketing language such as step into um, and any other clever language that AI often adds or cringe, cringy language and instead stick purely to simple language, but in a way that explains the topic, break down complicated paragraphs into simple bullet points or tables, create the outline, blah, blah, blah. So we're now just going to paste this into DeepSeek and what this is going to do. This is completely free. I don't even have an account. Oh no, I do have an account. Sorry. Um, I, I'm, I'm not paying for anything. I don't even know if you can pay for DeepSeek. So this will take a little bit of time. This is quite a big prompt, uh, but generally speaking, it doesn't really take that long. Um, so that's good. Now, if you think about this logically, once you have this in place, right? Once you have a prompt that you can use to easily write uh, blog posts with specific inputs, right? You can actually, if you think about it, you can start to programmatically generate this content for free on your computer. Because all you need to do is work out a way to put these inputs into the prompt for different articles, right? And then once you've done that, you can literally write articles using Olama, for example. Okay, so one thing that is still happening quite a lot with DeepSeek is the server is busy. Please try again later. This is very annoying. Um, I just want to try this and it's annoying that it doesn't work. So we'll just try this again 
on a an incognito. Oh, never mind. You actually do need to log in. Uh, if it doesn't work this time, I'll try a different way, or I'll just show you the one that I wrote before I start recording. Okay, so I've just I'm just using it on Open Router. This is still the seventy bill model. I'm just using it on Open Router instead. Um, it didn't seem to be working. So let's have a look at the reasoning here. There are multiple brands and product categories. The image embeds are all sneaker products, mostly from Premier to Kiton, K and T. Uh, the prices vary, with some on sale, indicating a price of around two hundred to seven seventy. So the likely user is e-commerce. So the user is likely an e-commerce business owner on blah, blah, blah. Okay, this all looks pretty good. Let's see what it comes out with here. So you can use this completely for free on chat.deepseat.com. However, because it's not working, I've just swapped over to Open Router, which by the way, is not free. Um, but I'm just doing it for this example uh, in, in, in the video, basically. So yeah, I mean it's doing a it's gonna it's doing a good job. Like it's it's got a good um header, key takeaways, as previously asked, and then you know everything else is fine here. Now one thing it is missing is the internal links. I'm really not sure why DeepSeek struggles so much with putting internal links into uh content. I've tried and tried to prompt it, it just doesn't really seem to understand what I'm trying to ask it. So I might just try and change this up. Um uh, mate sure to internally link to the website with keyword rich anchor text for example uh how do you do a markdown link i've completely forgotten uh, it's been a while since i've done one of these okay Okay, so I mean that should make it work a little bit better. Like I said, you'll be able to find this the, 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 this in the uh, description of this video, this prompt, this entire prompt will be there. Um, yeah, I'm not really happy with the result from uh, the API. I really, really wanted to use this, but it doesn't seem to be working. So I will just show you the example one that I wrote to test this out before I started recording, which of course worked as soon as I start recording, doesn't work. So we've got the title, key takeaways, list, beautiful. That is literally how to rank on Google right there. That, uh, those 100 words are how I rank on Google consistently. Introduction to 2025 sneaker trends. Okay, yeah, good. Images, brands to watch, beautiful, 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 beautiful. Really good, really nice short paragraphs. I love it. Um, let's just copy this. I'm going to assume that this is going to be uh, AI generated content according to uh, thingy, but we'll have a look. Oh, it does actually, it did actually leave links to um, Santoni, etc. I didn't realize that. That's actually amazing. So this is actually 10 out of 10, completely free, amazing, good. Let's just see GPT-0 what it says. I'm going to guess that it's going to say that it's completely AI generated, but we shall see in a moment. Okay, so 89%. It's actually not 100% AI generated. I could prompt this to not be AI generated at all. It wouldn't take me too long. If people want me to do this, let me know. Aside from that, guys, I'm going to leave the video there. You can find the prompt and everything in the description of this video. Thank you for watching. This is a completely free method of writing content using, using DeepSeek R1. Thanks for watching. If you're watching all the way to the end of this video, you're an absolute legend, and I'll see you very, very soon with some more content. Peace out.